up from a nap. <laughs> I, uh, what's nice about real estate is like, you can, you can just create your schedule however you want. So, um, what I do is my mom kind of calls me an old man. Um, I told my mom my schedule, right? So I wake up at 425 every single morning. My alarm goes off. I take five minutes to get the dust out of my eyes. And I go immediately when I wake up, <laughs> I go into my prayer devotional. I go upstairs, make myself some coffee, some toast, um, get a little something in the system. And I do my reading early on in the morning. And then at 6 a.m., then I'm, I'm personal training for a client of mine. Um, over at Anytime Fitness from like 6 to 7.30. And then <laughs> and then sometimes, well, most of the time when I come back after my lifting session, then I get an, a nap in at around like 8 o'clock. <laughs> so I sleep from like 8 to 9 or 8 to 10, um, depending on how much sleep I got like earlier on. But yeah, my mom, I told my mom my schedule <laughs> and she calls me an old man. So I don't know if that's good or bad. I just know that I want to get my allotted, I want to get my allotted of allotted amount of sleep in. Um, I'm going to do a cold calling session for you guys today. I, I haven't been on here in quite some time. Um, so I wanted to ha hop on the haps TV and, uh, I've really been rocking this prior Lake. I've really been rocking this prior Lake neighborhood. Um, every single time I've called, I think maybe one time I've called this neighborhood in the last week and I haven't got a hit on it. Yesterday, I talked to a woman who um, she wants to, um, it was a wrong number actually, and he is looking to sell around seven, probably around six, seven hundred thousand dollars um, over in Prior Lake. That was a really great conversation. I was on a training with a couple other agents at that time. So, um, let's see. It's weird. I can't see anybody's, I can't see a chat. I can't really see anything. They've kind of switched up this format on here. I don't know what's going on. Present, present on stream. I don't know. Anyways, I'm just going to go at it. I'm just going to give her, give her, <laughs> let's see what kind of activity. Hold on here. Just looking quick. Okay. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so, all right. I'm going to start calling, and I don't know if anyone's on here, if anyone's watching. I'm going to actually, hold on, hold on, hold on here. Hold on to your bootstraps. I'm going to go over to Facebook and see if I'm actually live right now. Okay. Okay. Okay, looks like I am live. Uh, kind of activity go. Hold on here. Okay. Okay, looks. Couple like minutes in. All right. Well, I'm gonna just get going. I'm gonna just um, start ringing, ring a ding dinging. I'll be calling in another agent as well. Her name's Kayla. She's going to be listening to my. She's gonna be listening in on my cold calls. All right. So I am going to. I'm going to tag her in right now so she can listen because I love to help. One to continue. I love to help other agents, all right? People that are looking to do something in real estate, I want to be able to help them uh, build a successful business, successful company. That's the goal of mine. And uh, we're just going to let it go. We're going to let it fly, baby. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on here, peeps. Hold on here, peeps. Kayla. Her name's Kayla. Kayla. I'll let her know, too, that I'm on a live. <clears throat> we'll call for an hour, you know, maybe an hour or so. Hello? So. Kayla. Hello, Patrick. Woo! Oh, did you hear my conversation yesterday with that with that seller? Um, yes, and it was <laughs> great. That was so. It's not. Um, these people are so easy, but you really knew how to talk and control, and it was like, wow, okay, so all these people didn't answer. But I have one question. 
Yeah. Oh, Can by I the way, by the way, oh, before you answer, ask that real quick, I wanted to let you know you are on a cold, you are on a live session right now. I have a platform called Haps TV, so it's on it's on Twitch, Facebook, and YouTube. It's a live cold calling session. Just wanted to let you know that, and it's okay. it's totally okay. So. Well, hello everyone. Um, <laughs> but I wanted to say that um, how did you get it? Where yesterday, you know how one would hang up or it would ring and go to the voicemail, and then you would call and it would just call another number. What is that? Yeah. Auto dialer. <clears throat> yeah. So that's an auto dialer. I have a triple line dialer that I use. And um, it drops the oh so are you familiar at all with Red X with their system? So my broker actually pays for Red X. Oh my gosh, that is so great. That's awesome. Yep. So, so, so it's basically just that. Yeah. Yes, it's a triple line dialer, and so that will it'll drop the voicemails in there for you and for yeah, and and oftentimes you'll get hits back from people who've heard your voicemail on there. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay. Yeah. So, so here I, I wanted to, I, I'm so happy and I'm so glad that you actually witnessed that yesterday. Um, I, I have called this Prior Lake. It's called Prior Lake. It's on the outskirts of Minneapolis. And um, it has been a really big, it's been a really big uh, gold mine so far. I've come across three individuals that, um, three individuals that want to sell down the road. But the thing is, is these little gold nuggets are sitting out there. And a lot of times, I mean, I, I've just really been getting lucky and the work has been, has been showing, but typically, you know, typically when I'm on lives or, <laughs> or if I'm training other agents and stuff, typically that does not happen. Usually I don't have those conversations. So I'm really glad you're able to hear that because that guy that I was talking to, uh, not only was that a totally wrong number, but he's actually looking to list and move to South Carolina. If you if you heard that conversation that we had, mm -hmm. so yeah, there's. They, I, I'm just happy and I'm glad that you're able to see the opportunity there because so many people they start into cold calling or they're either thinking about it or starting it and they don't see the benefits of it. But you were able to see it firsthand. You were able to hear that. You know. <laughs> yeah, that, it was beautiful. It gave me a lot more confidence, also. Oh. And a very good point because you know when you get into the real estate world a lot of people say work with your sphere of influence or you know door knock and things like that but you made such a good point with basically we're just collecting data we're just data collectors we're just data collectors that's all we're doing um kayla i wanted to i wanted you to say in front of the audience what 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 state are you from and kind of what's your position that you're in right now i think you told me you're getting your license correct yes so it took me a while um but I'm in the state of New Jersey. I am based out of Piscataway, but I want to work kind of, I don't want to say more of the wealthy areas, but I do want to go more towards the wealthy areas. I actually just did my first open house with someone um, this weekend on Saturday. It went very well. Oh, that's great. Love yeah, it. So it. It was really good. And you know, it was actually a $1.50 million house. So oh my, my gosh. House, it definitely opened a lot of uh, opportunities in the way of just, you know, like, expecting more of yourself yeah um but i still i have yet to get my license it should be here any day this week oh that's great okay so you passed the tests then yes i passed the oh test, thank god my license Woo! Um, and i'm just honestly i'm just gonna start cold calling tomorrow i'm gonna go with one of my mentors and she's gonna just show me how an inspection goes we're gonna go to a 55 and older community it's really more when you get into real estate and you know it takes a while to really pass that test and understand the content on oh my god on the test yes but what i can say is just put yourself in front of anyone that can help you or is willing to help you per se, if you're going into real estate, you know, you can join a team or, you know, you could be a solo agent, but one of my things is find a team that wants to, wants to help people and learn because when you're a new agent, you know, you don't have to learn anything. Well, you have, you have a lot to learn, but you don't have to relearn steps that someone else did. Right. You're basically a new agent where they can teach you however <clears throat> they want. So you're more of an asset than you realize. Right. Yeah, no, absolutely. That's the biggest thing is, and the biggest thing just from the very beginning is to finding that, finding that source of your leads, right? Finding out where, where am I going to get these leads from? You know, I, I think I mentioned yesterday, but there's only three ways to really go, go after business in, in, in the, in the, in the, in the real estate world, um, without, with, 
And uh, so door, whether it's door knocking, uh, open houses, like you're hammering some open houses, it sounds like. Okay. And then um, and then cold calling, exactly what we're doing. So, um, yeah. And, yeah, so for anybody that heard that, you know, anyone who's getting involved in real estate and stuff like that, you got to hit it head on like Kayla is. And she's reaching out to people that have been in the industry for a little bit of time. And uh, she's she's gaining that experience. So uh, w well done, Kayla. That's that's incredible. Thank you. Awesome. So you. I'm going to start up the vortex right now and we are going to hammer some neighbors. We're going to get sworn at. We're going to get hung up on. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that works. But um, I actually I have to hang up the call because okay. I do have an open house right now. But if yeah. you're doing tomorrow, please, please let me know because this these calls give me so much more confidence. Oh, great. It gets me prepared yeah. for what I do. And I also, I'm not going to lie, I take, I take some of your words from you also because I think it's very good. Oh, my gosh. Well, thanks so much. I appreciate that. I will. Yeah, so should I, I'll hit you up then tomorrow before we hop on the session? Yes, please. Okay, sounds good. I'll do that then, Kayla. All right, thank you. Enjoy the rest of your day. Goodbye, everyone. Okay, okay take care, Kayla. Thank you. Thank you, bye. Okay, bye-bye. Awesome. That was a great, uh, great conversation there. We're going to hop on right now. She witnessed. So I was, I had two agents on yesterday. I had two agents on that were, um, that were listening to me, right? That were Press one to continue. doing scripts with me that were doing scripts. I sent them my script that I use and Let's see, let's see, hold on here. Sorry, peeps, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, here we go, we're gonna hammer it. They were listening to my conversations yesterday and they heard that I, I came across, okay, we're ringing right now. Um, I, I came across that, uh, I came across that $700,000 seller, okay, out of Prior Lake area person wants to move over to South Carolina they want to get out of soda Hi, you Stephen Gross. Please. but this really isn't that tough the reason why I'm doing this the reason why I want to be on here with you is to show you and to teach you that there's so much possibility out there if we just make ourselves uncomfortable you know people are like I don't know how you do it I don't know how you do it I just do it and our body and our mind adjusts to it leave a message see if we can get someone on I'm not sure it's been really good hitting this neighborhood the past the call has been forwarded to an autom if you're watching right now um, or if you've been sitting on for a little bit watching go ahead throw a like down there um, throw a comment uh, where are you from what industry are you in maybe I don't know maybe you're Maybe my mom and dad are watching right now. I'm not sure. Well, you've reached Todd Clark. I'm on a bit. Hi, mom. Hi, hi, mom. Forwarded to an automated. Hi, grandma. This is Claire Clark. Hi, dad. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're gonna try and get someone on here. Hello. Yeah, Mr. Roberts. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, uh, Patrick Anderson here. I. <laughs> I know this call is totally out of the blue. Hope you guys have been doing well. Um, not far from you, there's actually a property over there that recently sold, and I'm a realtor with Remax. Uh, just wanted to check in real briefly here, and you know, see if there was anything in the world I could do for you guys or anyone else you might know. So. Oh, I don't think so. Gotcha, gotcha. You guys have been on Coachman there for quite okay. a while, I'm guessing, or. Yeah, I gotta get back to work here. Yeah, so. yeah. Okay, hey, one last thing here, Mr. Roberts, right before you go real quick. Um, if anything did come up for you guys down the road, uh, would you happen to have an, an honest realtor that you'd work with? Or is that okay if I shoot you over a little a little business card to your property? Uh, we actually have one that we use. Oh, you do? Okay. Hey, just wanted to make sure anyways yep. that you're good to go, okay? Sounds good. Thank you. All right, have a blessed rest of the year. Thank Bye -bye. you, sir. Bye-bye. And the biggest thing I say is this, all right? In business, in life, just always have a always have that personal 
always be personable, always have a positive presence. Um, I recently had connected with a, a woman named Michelle King. Hello, this is Samantha. Oh, Samantha. Uh, hey, Patrick Anderson here. I, <laughs> I know this call is totally random, but I was touching base briefly with some of the neighbors and hope you, hope you guys have been well. Um, not far from you, there's actually a property that recently sold and I'm a realtor with Remax. Uh, just wanted to check in briefly with you guys and, you know, see if there was anything in the world I could do for you or anyone else you might know, so. Um, that's nice of me to um, call and check in. I honestly don't have anybody that I know that's looking for anything right now, and we are currently, I guess, not looking for anything right now either. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm sorry. I wish I no. could more help. <laughs> no, no, no. Totally cool. Totally cool. It seems like you guys have, have you guys been around there for quite some time? It, uh, it seems like most, most of the people, they, they love this area. They really linger around for a while, huh? <laughs> yeah, we've been here five years. Oh, goodness. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Stay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Gotcha, gotcha. Well, yep. yeah, I know you have nothing going on now. Um, you know, if something did come up five, eight, eight, ten years down the road, uh, I'd be honored to be a valuable resource any way that I could. Uh, is that okay if I follow up with you guys down the road? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Oh, wonderful. Okay. I'll shoot a little business card to you guys over on Cherry Court there. And even if it collects dust, it's perfectly all right. And then uh, what's the best email for you as well? And I'll go ahead and just shoot you over some info. Sure. It's my last. This is her Samantha at Gmail, okay. Gmail.com, wonderful, okay. All right, well, yeah, if anything ever pops up, it does say, yeah, it says, it doesn't say Samantha, but it says uh, Christopher on here, so that must be the, the husband, I'm guessing. <laughs> wonderful, okay, well, thank you so much, Samantha, and I wish you a blessed rest of the year, okay? Okay, thanks so much, bye-bye now. Great. Okay, so perfect, bang, first one in the books. Um, that was a, okay, so, sorry, I'm just writing some stuff down here. Be patient, please. Cherry Court. Prior Lake. <clears throat> okay, on to the next one, should we? Let's go, baby! Woo! Come on! We're having fun. I literally, my buddy and I, my buddy and I, Jake, we literally sit in the, um, <laughs> we literally sit in this, like, office space. It's like a, it's like a kitchen space at his apartment. And we just roll, we laugh, we just have a fun time. <laughs> And it's just a hell of a time. We really do um, love it and enjoy it. And I can't see anyone's comments or anything if, if anyone does leave a comment, but it seems like... Um... ...has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Okay, here's what it's showing. Six, nice. One, oh. two, two, seven, zero, nine, I use... Eight, um... Three... Eight. Just so I can answer some available. of these. Oh crap! Hold on. At the tone, please record your message. When hey, you... hey guys, if you're if you're watching, just so I can answer some of these questions. Adam Alexander said, "What auto dialer software? I use um, I use Redex is what I use, and Marina. Oh, you're the best, Marina. Um, I appreciate you so much. Um, a couple people are watching, I guess. Nice. Um, okay." Leave me a message. Perfect, perfect. I use triple. I use a triple line dialer. Hi, this is Dave. With uh, Hi. it's called Red X. The system is Red X. So. Number nine five. If that helped answer any questions of yours. If you have any other questions about what I'm doing. Hi, you've reached the phone of Ron. If you have questions about what I'm doing... Hello. You have reached a phone number that is no longer in service. 
If you are trying to reach the Allens, please call us on our cell phones. Thank you. If you have any other questions, just send me a... Go ahead and ask. Hello? Please leave your message for... Number nine five two. I um. When when the calls are going through, typically what I'll be doing is I'll be writing cards. So, this is the card that I use. You can see that. Okay. I send this card out to them, and I write a little message on the back. Okay. Nice, Courtney. Hello. We are not available now. Please leave. Courtney liked my Courtney liked my video. Please state your name after the top. Wasn't mom or dad, but Courtney did. Thanks, Court. Hi, this is Rich. Courtney Anderson is my sister. Um, she's up in Crookston, northern Minnesota. Oh boy, we're already 40 calls in, peeps. Woo! We're cruising. Hello? Hi, you... Please let me know when you... When you... Shoot. Hello. Hey, Mr. And Mrs. Byrons? Uh, wrong number. Oh, no. Shoot. So here's what I do on a wrong number, people. So here's what I do on a wrong number. When when it's a wrong number, I'll typically try and squeeze it in there and say... Sorry, the person you are trying to reach has a voicemail box that has not been set up yet. Please try your call again later. Goodbye. I'll uh, squeeze it in there and say... The first question I ask is, Hey, is there anything in the world... Or, or I say... Um, to an automatic voice message system. Or I say, hey, I was hoping you could help me out real quick here. Can you help me? And most of the time, people want to help. See? Psychologically, our minds are built to want to help people and do good. Hi, you have reached So, <laughs> I ask them if they can help me quick. <laughs> Even if it's a wrong number, right? And so, yesterday when I had that conversation with that, with that gentleman that want, is looking to list, um, that's what... Hi, I'm away from my phone. That's what the conversation kind of entailed is I asked him, I kept him on the phone, right? And I said, hey, can you help me out real quick? I, I'm trying to to put this puzzle together, right? <laughs> We're not here right now. Please, when you, uh, please let me know when you're... Hopefully we get some more on here, people. Sorry, it's kind of... Hello? Hello, spam? Oh, Mr. and Mrs. Wagner? No, I, this is a real person. This isn't a robot. <laughs> okay, it came up as spam. Oh, oh, spam likely or spam? <laughs> uh, spam likely. Oh, I'm typically not a... I, I typically don't eat too much spam, so we can keep that in the, in the, in the pantry. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you can fry it and it still tastes good. <laughs> or, or by the campfire out, out, up in the boundary waters, right? There you go. You know, you, you slice <laughs> it up and uh, nobody knows the difference. <laughs> Love it. 
<laughs> yeah. Um. Hey, real quick. Yeah, real quick here for you. I know you're like, who the heck is this? So, uh, my name is Patrick Anderson, and I was touching base briefly with some of the neighbors over there in Prior Lake. I know. I know this call is totally random. Um, not far from you, there's a property that recently sold, and I'm a realtor with Remax. Uh, you know, just wanted to check in with you guys is all, and see if there was anything in the world I could do for you or anyone else you might know. So. Oh, uh, I do security sales. I was wondering if you need a security system. Oh, what what uh, what kind of systems yeah. do you work with? Well, we do residential. I also do commercial. I like the commercial and more of it. You know. Yeah. Right. Uh, everything from access, video, bird. Residential security. Okay, I'm jotting down your name. Is it is it Ra is it Ralph Wagner? Yeah, I'm with Midwest Alarm out of Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Woo! Midwest Alarm. Got you. I um, it's funny you say it's Sioux Falls, South Dakota, because I um, I graduated from USF down there. I played ball for them for two years. Um, and uh, I ended up moving up here, opened up my business in real estate, but. I love South Dakota. I've every single time I go to Sioux Falls, I have tons of, you know, bill relationships there, and uh, Sioux Falls is a great place. So when you're in Sioux Falls going to school, did you go to school, you play ball with C.J. Ham. Yes, well, C.J. Ham, yeah, yeah, yeah. So he was with um, Aug he was with Augustana, and uh, yeah, he um, during during the time that I was playing ball, around 2016, he was just graduating there and, and going. Trying out for the NFL right shortly after that. Yeah. <laughs> yep. That's awesome. Wow. So do you go back and forth all the time from here down there, here down there? No, I used to work nationwide sales. And then uh, I met this company and I said, wow, this looks like it could grow. And I met CJ Ham at a charity event. Oh, wow. Working it. That's how I just got to meet CJ. Wow. Okay. And you went and played ball there. That's right. where it came into play. Right, right. So, yeah, I used to be. So, whenever I get calls like this, uh, they come up as potential spam. It's like, <laughs> oh, it's flipping into sales. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man, yeah, sometimes, I don't know. Sometimes it does say Patrick, or sometimes my number pops up. It's always a mixed bag, so. <laughs> well, yeah, and I mean. I all that. What's that? I understand how it works. Right, right. Yeah, and if anything did pop up for you, even down the road, whether it was, you know, whether it's investing in real estate or if you guys are looking to make a move at all, I'd be honored to, uh, I'd, I'd be honored to be a valuable resource for you any way I could. Uh, I can, I can go, right. I'll send a little business. Right, I'll be honest with you. Yeah? I, I'm about two years out before I look at selling. I got one, one teenager that's got a couple of years left sure, before sure. I sell. Yeah. I want to make sure she's on her own before I do anything like that. Oh, right, right. Yeah, yeah, and it's about, you know, the reason I make these calls is so that I can build long-term relationship with people, you know. The biggest thing I say is, you know, even if you're three, five, eight years out, I, I'd still be honored to, to build a valuable relationship with you for the long-term, you know, so. Put in a database for a couple of years, huh? Yeah, no, I'm, oh, uh, building a, build a data, database, you said? I said just put my data, put me in your data for a couple of sure. years out. Yeah. I'm not going to do anything for a couple of years. Yeah, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, and I'm not going to be uh, pestering you all the time or anything like that, but I can, uh, I'll just shoot a little info over to you. What, what's the best email for you? rwagner3 at hotmail.com. Hotmail, gotcha. Okay, and then I'll just send a little business card to you as well. And even if it collects dust, that's perfectly all right. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Ralph. It was such a pleasure talking with you, and I wish you a blessed rest of the year. Okay. Take care. Bye. -bye. Okay. Thanks so much. Bye bye. So I will put him. That's a great conversation right there. Bang. You know, that's a that's a potential listing in two years. And so that's the thing, is looking at this in the long haul, all right, having valuable conversation and uh, building relationship with them in the long haul, you know. I will set them up, once I, get, once I get someone like that that's looking to go in two years, I'll set them up on a couple things. I'll put them in my database. Hello? 
Mr. And Mrs. Block, hello. I will put them in my database, number one. I'll put them on HomeBot, okay? HomeBot is a system that um, consistently, it consistently sends your, it consistently sends out every single month, they get an email that shows their home value, okay? And what they use is they use either an AVM or they use an RVM. And the RVM is one of the most accurate systems that they have. It's not a Zillow estimate or from realtor.com. It's called RVM and it takes data from all of these different sites and computes it into one system. And it's called a realtor's valuation model. I set them up on a home bot with their email and they're able to see and keep tabs on the value of their home. There's tons of information in there. It's really been a blessing getting set up with HomeBot. So I do that. I also set up, um, I also set up them up on my constant contact newsletter. And hello. Hi, you have reached Grandy. And so I set them up on my newsletter. Okay. very passionate about real estate I think that most people thank you for calling the person you're calling is not a <clears throat> I think if most people got into real estate they'd really enjoy it no you've reached the voicemail of Emily Gore and I'm unable to answer and my phone right now but if yeah I just message, I'll make sure to call you love back. what I do yeah. and I love you guys too for all of your support um, my family has been really supportive of me it's a grind, man. It's it's a roller coaster. Um, owning your own company is a. Hello. Hello. Hello, Mr. And Mrs. Zabel Zabel. Hello. Um, a lot of people don't know how we are employed in real estate. Real estate is. Hi, you've reached Kate. Please leave him. Real estate is 100% commission, so you're not working hourly. You're not working for a brokerage. The brokerage works for you and holds your liability as a 1099 contractor. Um, you're an Nine, five, two. In real estate, you are an independent contractor, and um, you build your own business, man. You put yourself out there. Um, Hello. Yeah. Yeah, Mr. And Mrs. Mo yeah, Mr. And Mrs. Mosser or Moser. You got the wrong number. Is this a? I assume you must be a spam caller. No. <laughs> so the last the last neighbor I had talked to, so yeah, sometimes these numbers get mixed up. But the last uh, neighbor I had talked to said it said potential spam, and it's really a hit or miss if it comes up with a number or spam. But no, I was uh, I was touching base with some of the neighbors. My name is Patrick Anderson. You're your number's tied on to Coachman Lane over in Prior Lake. Did you guys used to live over there, I'm guessing, or did you sell that place? Yes, we sold it. Oh, you did. Okay, okay, yeah. And the reason I was reaching out, I'm, I'm a realtor with Remax in the area. So, yeah, I was just checking in to see if there was anything I could do for you guys and not not sure what you're nope. – well, you we're, we're in Florida, so thanks but no thanks. <laughs> awesome. Well, have fun in the sunshine. I appreciate it. Thank you, sir. Okay. Appreciate it. Thank Bye -bye. you. Bye-bye. Guess what, guys? So here's the deal. I'm going to let you in on a tidbit of information. I come across so many people that I cold call, especially in the outer skirt, the outer metro, um, that move down to Florida and that have either, they have either family down in Florida or they are interested in moving down there. And everyone's going down to Florida, <laughs> including me down the road. And my parents aren't going to. My parents aren't going to like Hello, that. you have reached Shen Young with Cincinnati. They're not going to like me moving down there. And I have quite a few roots here. In, uh, you reached Ben Hernandez. Quite a few roots here in Minnesota, but... Family, family. Oh, it's been forwarded. 
forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Hello? Please leave your message for... Hi, you've reached Diana. Please leave a... Yeah, Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Drulo? Yeah, this is Tom. Yeah, Tom. Hey, uh, Patrick Anderson here. I <laughs> I know this call is totally random, but I was touching base briefly with some of the neighbors and hope you guys have been well. Um, not far from you guys over there, there's a property that recently sold and I'm a realtor with Remax. Uh, just wanted to check in real briefly and you know see if there was anything in the world I could do for you guys or anyone else you might know. So... Uh, no, not this time. <clears throat> gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, it's most of the people I talk to around Cherry Court over there, they seem to they seem to linger around for quite some time. It <laughs> seems like the place to be, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty nice neighborhood. Man, uh, how long have you guys been there for? Have you been there since it was built, or a couple years, or? Yeah, I actually built it myself 21 years ago. You did? Oh my goodness. Yeah, not 98 it says here, yeah. Well, awesome. Yeah, I'm not sure what you guys had a timeline down the road, but you know, even even if something happened three, five, ten years down the road, um, I'd be honored to be a valuable resource any way I could. Uh, is that okay if I touch base here and there as time goes on? Sure. Okay, awesome. I'll go ahead and send over a little business card to you on, to you on Cherry, and even if it collects dust, it's perfectly all right. Uh, and then what, what's the best email for you as well? And I'll just go ahead and shoot you over an email with some info. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. And one, one last quick question here, Tom. Um, what, did my number, what did my number come up as? Did it say spam on there or did it say a phone number? Oh, it does. Okay. So it's either a hit or miss. Some people answer and they go, uh, this says spam here. Who is this? <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Gotcha. Well, hey, we got lucky on this one, Tom. So. <laughs> All right. Well, hey, I hope you and the family have a very blessed rest of the year. Okay. Okay. All right. Thanks so much. Bye bye now. Boom. That's how, that's how it is. All right. So everybody we are talking to, we're just, we're just building a friendship base, you know, <laughs> that's all we're doing. You want two, nine, four, nine, nine. Okay. We're just building a base of friends. Okay. We'll do one more. We'll do one more for you, and um, then I'm gonna hop off. Okay. And uh, yeah, I'll do I'll do a cold calling live session every single week. So when you see me on here, hey, go ahead. When you whenever you see me on here uh, in the week time, go ahead and just throw a little like on there and uh, throw you know go ahead put some put some money in my Venmo account and. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding about that. I'm just kidding. I know some people would be like, did he really just say that on camera? <laughs> Hello? Oh. No bueno. <clears throat> Come on, baby. Let's get one. Let's get a hot dog on the grill. Hello? Oh man.
Hello? Uh oh. Hello? Hello, is anyone there? Oh man, what the heck's going on? Okay, it looks like... <laughs> wow, I, I probably lost two conversations there. <laughs> ah, I don't know what's happening. Okay, all right, hey, we're gonna, we're gonna just end right here, guys. Thanks so much for joining. Thank you so much for joining. Thanks for being on, appreciate you. Go ahead, throw a little like on there if you liked it. If you didn't like it, then put a thumbs down. I appreciate you anyways, love you. And uh, yeah, Patrick Anderson here with Remax. Let me know if you ever come across anyone who's looking to do anything in real estate or if you come across people um, that are looking to um, 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 have a career in real estate as well. Would love to chat with you. Thanks so much, guys. Love you. Bye-bye.